And here is our Lavoid Core 400. And the Lavoid Core 400 and the Lavoid Core 300 are two of the most popular air purifiers. The Core 300S is going to come with the Smart App ability. So now you get the Core 300 with a Smart App built in, along with a 12 hour, along with a 12 hour timer, updated features and a smaller motor that gives you the same output so it's quieter. So the motor is almost nearly double here so this is using a lot less electricity. It is doing the same job so it's going to be able to filter your room. A 219 square foot room every 12 minutes or every five times. It is extremely quiet. It comes with pretty much the same filter now. I mean they do come with the same filter. So here's the filter on your core 300 and here's the filter on your core 300s they're the same so this has a air quality indicator because you have an auto mode and that's an update that you're getting in your core 300s and the core 300 does not come with an auto mode so this is a air quality sensor. So when it's blue, it's that detects, that means it's good. Here, we are gonna turn ours on. There's no ring, there's no ring here. There's no ring there. There's a night mode. There's a timer up to eight hours. You have your fan speed, one, two, three. One, two, three. You can turn off the lights just by pressing lights off. You can turn it on night mode and you can turn it off. So that's your lock and your change filter. Now let's look at the Core 300 s because this one has suddenly has a lot more features. So you have your auto mode and we're on auto or we can go on manual and this is fan speed one, two, three. You have your night mode and if you hold the button down that will become reset filter. So now it's just gonna, it's on, but the lights are all off. You have your timer, and your timer indicates right there. So that's your timer display. It's gonna say one, two, up to 12 hours. You have your lock, your lights, your night, your night light. So you turn off all your lights, not your night light. So this button will turn off all your lights, and you have your auto mode. So now that we have our device on, let's pair it with our phone. And these are my current devices from, and is, at, is actually founded right there. It says, do you want to add the Lavoid Smart HEP2 HEPA air purifier? Yes, we want to add it. It's going to ask us to hold the power button for five seconds. So let's do that together. Hold power button for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And you can see that the blue indicator light is flashing now. So we're gonna give it a device name so I can use it using my Google Assistant or my Amazon Alexa. And here are all my various devices. R300N is already lit up because it's on. We can go to it and it's saying, it's letting me know that my air quality is very good because there's a particle sensor in there up to 2.5 microns. So there's a sensor in here, but the lights are all off, right? Because we have it on night mode. So let's turn it on off night mode. We'll turn on our timer and will show you, I can now use it with my phone. I can turn it off, it's off. I can also turn it back on. I can change the fan speed. Medium, high, low, sleep. I can set the timer. So I can set the timer here. And that's up to every a minute. You can also do scheduling just by changing it from daily to weekly. So you can do all of that using your Core 300S. And because it has that ARSI Plus technology, it has that laser air sensor that you find right on the back of it. And we'll show you that. This is another difference between your Core 300 and your Core 300S. You can see it right here. Bring it up. You have your AirSight Plus versus there's nothing. Your actual. So 23 watts. This is new. 23 watts. You can even see that they, they this is, they put a sticker on it. They put a sticker on it because it was 
It was even higher before, so they fixed it. And the noise level is 22 to 50. So this is lower. These stats are lower than on your core 200. One key note that we want to give, just a pro tip, for best results or to address a specific air quality issue such as smoke, run the air purifier at high speed, level 3, for 15 to 20 minutes before using a lower speed. Alexa, turn off the 300S. Okay. It's off. Alexa, turn on the 300S. Okay. Alexa, turn the fan speed up on 300S. Okay. Alexa, turn off the 300S. Okay. And that means I can turn it on and off anywhere. I don't have to be home. And because on the app, on the app, I have a, I have a, I have a laser particle sensor it's letting me know the air quality so if this is bad i can just turn it on remotely i can use my um, google assistant or alexa app to turn it on and then it works perfectly i always will know and always will have clean air in my bedroom or my small room up to 219 square feet so these are all the siblings to the core 300 you have your core 400s you have your core 300 and you have your core 200 s so these are the three different sizes that they all come in now let me talk to you about what the differences are between them these two will come with a laser particle air sensor this will not come with that this will be for a 181 square foot room a 219 and a 420 uh, square foot room cycling every 12 minutes eight hour timer 12 hour timer 12 hour timer but the menus are pretty much straightforward. The filters are all kind of like, they're also very similar. So we'll take out the filters on each one so you can see the differences. So you can see that the Core 300 is in between. Now the Core 400 is a substantially larger filter. In terms of their design, they all are 360 degree air intakes. You can see also in the thickness between them all that the Core 300 has a much thicker filter than the Core 200S but it is about the same thickness as the Core 400S. Now the Core 300S might represent the new pinnacle in small room air purifier. So up to a room 220 square feet, this one does it all. You have lights off, you have the app, you have the Alexa control. So <clears throat> I can control mine using my Alexa now.